I'm in Austin, Texas. <laughs> I'm glad you asked. <laughs> it's good. Best decision ever. I'm glad. Uh, I'm glad Marissa went with it. Uh, it's good. Um, that yeah, it just happened. It snuck up on me. It was October last year, 29th, 29th of October. Did it in Canada. Uh, the wedding that is. <laughs> no, it, not not really. We have we have three fuzzy kids. There's Penelope the dog, Nova Scotia the cat, and Nico the rabbit. Right now, yes, yes, very much so. Mm -hmm. It happened. It's a tidbit nipply. <laughs> is what my wife wanted to say. What did to say? Oh, you know, I've been playing a lot of basketball or just shooting baskets, really. Um, hanging out and working, uh, like learning how to code for a thing called Urbit. Oh yeah, David Deutsch, The Beginning of Infinity. It's a good book. Oh, shows? Uh, Deep Space Nine, Gilmore Girls, Frasier, Cheers. Yeah, a lot of good stuff. <laughs> Why did I put that question in there? Um, mostly like protein shakes <laughs> and meatloaf and chicken. Uh, we've been, we're on the Costco train and we're all about it. I am like, I'm crunching on, that does it, crushing? I'm crushing on Dan Harmon in the Harmontown podcast, but like I cannot recommend that to anybody. It's like, it's not, not appropriate. Oh, yes, yes. Home is a thing. It's, it's definitely going through, uh... A metamorphosis as it always does but yeah hang out with musicians is still a thing especially as a podcast podcast that um as a podcast uh, my own like little way not so directly um i'm learning that i need to like lead by example and make a thing that succeeds and then like literally, then, then maybe people will ask me for my help once they, once they see that I've already found success and have what they want. So taking a new, new suave little tactic. <laughs> oh, um, because you can't, you can't lead a horse to water. Uh, yeah, just can't do it. Um, well, the point, I would have to say now the point of the podcast is going to be championing one of my, my favorite charities, uh, Give Directly. And so getting money directed towards them and also like just like having the podcast be more of a thing and really to kind of um, just be out there myself and Megs as the hosts of Hangout Musicians, just kind of putting ourselves out there on a regular basis. That's like... That's kind of the point. Oh, Patreon. Yes. Yes, I'm still doing Patreon because I need to make money because I'm married now. Uh, well, one, you help continue the Hangout with Musicians podcast because it takes up a lot of my time. And if I'm going to do it, it needs to be money now because I'm married. And one, one thing that I'm interested in is like giving digital swag, <laughs> uh, so like NFTs and stuff, representing the uh, the podcast. Oh, you know what? I got it. Here's what patrons get: you get to tell me who you think should be on the podcast and who I should interview, and also get NFT digital swag. Um, you know, like on Ethereum and stuff. If you know about it, you know about it. If you don't, it's fine. Uh, yes. So yeah, yeah. Give directly directly is awesome it's still great i'm still giving a portion of what i what's given to me every month to them because that's how i like to do <laughs> uh you know what yeah the, the, for the first time in the past couple of years i could actually say yeah I, I, I got a real job i'm um uh, i i do i install high-end closets all around austin oh i don't even know all around all around austin yeah you, you already know i'm in austin Urbit. What is Urbit? Do you have an hour or two? Um, uh, I guess, you know, now this video has become 45 minutes. Uh, Urbit is where I'm learning to code. It's basically they reinvented the computer 
in light of what we now know we need for the internet. And so it's a new computer that allows for a new, better internet. It'll be big in like five or six years. Maybe you'll start hearing about it in three. Uh, it's basically like you'll 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 want to be there. You don't know about it now, but everybody will be will want to be on Urbit. So I learned how to code for it. I built an app. Um, that's another thing I've been up to. So there's a little focus interval app thing. I'll, I'll link to it. It's it's uh, I use it every day. <laughs> uh, when I grow up, I want to be um, completely free. I want I want to be. I guess I just want to like be on a ranch. Be, be having chickens, I guess a farmer. So I guess that's what I want to be. An astronaut would be cool too. Um, uh, probably not. Uh, definitely not the way that I have been doing it. The podcast, like, have in the past taken me like fifteen hours or like like weeks to finish and do. And I need it. I need it to be a lot more narrow. So the how I'd like to do it, I should be able to. Um, beep, beep, boop, 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 boop. Do you want to try the segment again? I think it's fine. Okay. I don't see. I don't see any reason to. I just kind of. I thought I really had to milk it. So, uh, a big plan for 2023. Well, on Urbit, I would like to make a guitar course. I'd like to put up a guitar course, and um, that might be another thing patrons get is like little. Little little tidbits of uh, guitar courses coming out and being being made, and so I think that would be neat. Any big trips? I'm hoping to go to El Salvador. It's kind of up in the air right now, but uh, uh, El Salvador in March would be pretty awesome. Oh yeah, and then I hope in the summer to to go to Canada, Canada again. Let's go back. Oh right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Uh, we'll see you in the next one. Bye.